thank you. Speaking of the bowl game, the Wildcats are about 12 hours away from kicking off their bowl game in Louisiana. But the pride behind the football team, the marching band, is being left out this year. Here to explain why is Nine on Your Side, Simone de Rosario. Simone. Well, Stella, money, logistics, and the peculiar bowl placement all play a factor in why the pride of Arizona will be absent for the first time in decades. But in an unusual twist, the band director says you'll only see in the music world, Wildcat fans will still get to sing along and jump around to bear down. Here's how. They've pumped up crowds and cheered the Wildcats on to a winning season and all the way to the Advocare V100 Bowl game in Shreveport, Louisiana. It's not Pac-12 affiliated, it's not close, and band director Jay Reese tells Nine on Your Side it posed some serious logistical problems. When the band and athletic department first looked at flying the Pride of Arizona to the game, Reese says flights alone for the band could cost the department two to three hundred thousand dollars. That did not include hotels or the cost of feeding 250 band members. Taking buses had its own challenges, like a six-day trip more than 1,100 miles each way for a two-day event. But even without the physical presence of the pride of Arizona, their spirit lives on. As a college in Louisiana, the Northwestern State University's award-winning marching band takes on the likes of Bear Down in All Hail Arizona, ditching their traditional purple for two days and donating cardinal red and blue. The U of A is paying the band program for their cost and time, a much smaller price tag than if the pride were to march to Louisiana. Now the band director tells me this is the first time since 1990 the Pride of Arizona will not cheer on the football team in a bowl game. That bowl game took place in Hawaii, go figure, and Arizona was shut out by Syracuse 28-0. to Now I'm sure the Wildcat fans with the help of this substitute band are hoping for a much different outcome tomorrow. Guy?